Blackberry Jam first started out as a cover band. From like 96 to 2000, we was testing the Wathers, trying to find her sound. Around 2000, I was able to meet my friend and longtime music collaborator, Jumbo Shrimp, and he's front man, lead singer. So from that point on, we went from being like a R&B, jazz cover band to a funk, rock, original based band. We transitioned from the smoothness to the rock, and we've been grooving ever since. The Blackberry Jam sound is pretty much anything under the funk umbrella. Funk is an assortment of different sounds, a lot of rock influence, funk jazz, R&B, hip hop, reggae, Afro beat, you name it. To me, if you can move your head to it, it's funk. It represents what the musicians in the band are about. All the musicians are diverse and are willing to experiment and expand, and our music portrays that. A lot of our song, lyric-wise, has a lot to do with social issues, pro-righteousness, love, pro-peace, trying to make this society a better society, you know, for everyone, and just everyone doing their part, you know, to make this world a better place. That's a big part of what our lyrics are about and our message that we're trying to relay to the world with our music. So it ends up being by default lyrics with a really serious message going on top of a funky, fun-loving party group. We want to bring the message that we're coming and jamming out of love, peace, and respect, you know, for the people that come out to see us play. Plus, I believe music brings people together. So if we're wanting to bring people together, the best way to do it is to be as diverse as we could possibly be. I do believe Blackberry Jam is able to bring a diverse crowd. And I mean, we're talking about, you know, white folks, you know, black folks, you know, it doesn't matter what nationality, you know, what race, what, you know, creed, you know what I'm saying? We represent love. Being at this band for 20 plus years, since 1996, the one lesson that's held true the most is just put all your effort into it, be positive, and expect nothing. The band is able to survive because there's a natural love that just been instilled in us. I mean, it's, it's like in our blood. So it's like, keep it going, you know? Keep it going until you just can't go no more and we're not even close to that point. I don't even know if we'll ever get to that point.